war. Identify yourself! No one can know Umbrella was involved. Raccoon City doesn't have long. Get down! There are no survivors. They're all dead. Survival is your responsibility. Okay, what's up everybody? This is the game virus also known as the GGGGGG virus and we are back at it again with more Let's play Resident Evil 2 knife only with zero practice zero rehearsal zero experience with just this Thing here you see that it thing that he's wielding no experience with going through this entire Game with just this none so last episode I told you guys that I was gonna go back and um Bring you guys back after I fucking redid that shit with Ada because I didn't want to save again. But then I realized I need to save again in case I need to retry this next part that I'm about to do right here. In case I get poisoned here. In case the liquors get me. In case something happens. I just need to save as much as I need to save. And I didn't want to because I was low on ink ribbons. Get away from the wall. Get away from the wall. It's going to come running. Woof! Close. It's very easy to get hit there, even if you're hugging the wall, that son of a bitch will always sort of kind of nail you. Okay. Uh, dogs shouldn't be out. We're still in there. Yeah, it's a good thing I didn't go for that red herb, because I gotta come back through here and go back down every time I gotta dodge those dogs. So that red herb, although I want it, I gotta just ignore it, because upon picking it up, those dogs will come out of there and sink their teeth into my tight RPD ass my tight rookie ass it will oh shit oh shit no oh, never mind I'm over here oh shit oh shit oh there's dogs here oh, meanwhile they don't even respond to my presence I was only saying that because I didn't know there's gonna be enemies here no liquors there's liquors here there's gotta be no liquors no liquors Wow, B scenario is so lenient. Now, oh, fuck that. I don't think I need to go into the autopsy room at all. I think the only thing it has is the red key card that allows me into the weapons room so I can get a side pack and shit. If there's zombies in here, I might think about it. No, there's liquors. It's not worth it. Why? Why bother? But a side pack might be helpful in case I end up pulling down a lot of health Let's see one two three four five six seven seven health items I could fit on me if I need more than seven for these final fights then I don't know what to tell you I'm definitely not gonna go for that side pack because I'm not stupid but what I am gonna go for is what is this unlock again hmm I'm not sure, but I want to say that there might be health over here. It unlocks this stupid door. Oh, and the door so I can get that gear. Now I remember. Oh, that means I gotta dodge those... Gotta dodge those damn zombies again. Oh, we don't need that. I don't know why I thought there was health here. Perhaps there is an ink ribbon here. Yeah, 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 there is. Perfect. We need ink ribbons. Much needed. Any health, though? Health is needed, always. Even though I have a lot, I'll gladly take more. If Leon gets off this table. Magnum bullets. I would love to fire the Magnum right now. <sighs> it feels so good to just play this game normal after you've been playing it with just a knife for a while. It feels so good to just blast something to oblivion. It's just so, so satisfying to feel the feedback of just blowing a zombie apart. Well, this is recording, isn't it? Okay, just checking my shit. Just checking my shit. Making sure my shit is going. Oh, where's this dog? I might get nailed here. I don't know where this dog's at. Don't know how far down he is. Oh, he's not even aware. Just one dog in here, huh? 
He's not even aware. I'm just gonna calmly walk and run past him. <clears throat> Whew. All right, it's up to me what I want to do next. Uh, this is gonna be tricky. I already know. I'm just gonna go for um, I'm gonna go for the police chief's offices first, and then I'll probably save because it's gonna be hard for me to get back to that area. I gotta dodge those effing zombies again once I go through the those offices for the cops. Once I go through there, through the double doors, I gotta dodge those damn zombies again. It'll be a pain in the ass. I could get hurt. And my goal is to go through this without getting hurt. So I have as much health as humanly possible on me. Damn, these liquors are still here! Even though the wreckage is cleared out? Ugh. I thought for sure they'd be gone. Ugh, this could be bad. If I get hit, I'm not gonna restart it. One hit, I won't restart. Like two hits though, I'm gonna have to restart. What is it I'm even getting here? I think I'm getting the crank. It's gonna be in that box. Claire gets a fucking first aid spray. Lucky her, I get a fucking key item. That's bullshit. <laughs> the Lord was with me. The Lord was with me for that encounter right there. He said, don't worry, G-Virus. I'll guide you. And he guided my thumbs through that shit. And there's no dead woman on here. That's weird. Chief's diaries. She can't even mess with this. All this is just for the crank, man. I'm about to get socked in the head by Mr. X just for an effing crank. Can I just leave? Or will he stay here? I can just leave. I can just leave. I couldn't leave the first time because the, the way was blocked off, but once he shows up, I can just go and he'll be gone, right? Hmm. I think that's the case. That would be perfect, man. This would be... Oh, this, this playthrough is being so much more kind to me than Claire's was. Ooh, I tell you. Yeah, it's just for the lousy crank. I'd rather have a first aid spray. Funky ass crank. Lousy ass diary. You don't give a shit. I don't give a shit. Give me health. You gonna throw all these assholes at me? Pretty much got a boss that follows you around and shit. Let me just, just see him fucking walking. There he goes. Get the fuck away from him. Big motherfucker. Fuck you. Yeah, let's see. He shouldn't... He might still be out there. I can't remember. I, I rarely... Usually when I'm playing, I just let him hit me and run past him or I drop him. Let's see if he's still gonna be out here. Yeah, he's still out here. That's crazy. I gotta, I gotta take the hit. He's not going anywhere. I gotta take the fucking hit. That's crazy. Huh. I'm not going anywhere, son. You gotta take this ass whooping. One way or the other. You gonna get this ass whooping, boy. One way or the other. Fuck. Well. This is gonna be my first bit of damage in a long time. Oh! I almost dodged him. Oh, that's bullshit. He gets to hit me twice. Oh, he gets to hit me three times. That's bullshit. Ah, oh, shit. I should have fucking waited some. I gotta do that over. No, no, no. Still, still in caution. No, no, no. I gotta do that over. <laughs> I'm sorry. Usually when he socks you, he goes for a double axe handle. He tries to hit you with a double axe handle swing. Of his arms and that's when you can run past him but he had me in the corner and I, I wasn't right in front of him so he kept hitting me and then he went for the double axe handle once he was basically in front of me because he had to uh, it's weird he had to keep walking towards me to get in front of me it's bullshit it shouldn't have happened like that I have to do it over again I must it's a necess it's necessary 
I got to do it. Which means I gotta dodge all those fuckers again. <sighs> this is why I saved after all. When I told you I wasn't going to. <sighs> Man. Believe it or not, I dodged a lot of enemies though. I gotta do all that again. I gotta dodge dogs and spiders and shit again. Gotta be careful to dodge this guy. Yeah. Then I gotta dodge the dogs that are in the parking lot. Then I gotta dodge the single dog up in that hallway, and then I'm free. Fuck you, Mr. X. I guess he wouldn't really be much of a threat if you you could just walk out of the room that he's in, and you know, never. It's if you make it to the other side, he won't be there anymore. But if you go back into the room where you were before you first saw him, before he, before he shows up. If you go back in there, he's not gonna disappear. He's gonna still be there waiting for your ass. You gotta, you gotta come see him. Oh, these guys, those dogs are like, they're on something, man. They're on some type of medication. They, they're just not aware of me at all. That's the second time they just fucking just let me waltz my happy rookie ass on through right past them and they didn't say a damn thing my wet behind the ears fucking novice ass rookie butt just let me go right on by no, let's go get that ink ribbon very important very important yeah, I'm certain if I had gone further into that library, the zombies would have came pouring out. The shutters on the west, the west wing would have shorted out. <clears throat> and I would have been in dear trouble, big trouble. Much exactly how it happened the first time. Good shit. All right, now if we can just take one hit from Mr. X, we'll be good. Oh, I still gotta get past the liquors, man. Ugh. Fuck, man. Why did Mr. X have to screw shit up? Why? Why couldn't you just hit me once, like you're supposed to, and then gone for your big heavy hit? And that way I can just run past you. Why did you have to be extra about it? If I get hit by the liquor here, I'm gonna, I'm gonna have to. Uh, I can't keep saving, man. I'm just wasting, wasting ink ribbons. Good shit. Once again, the Lord has guided me, has taken control of my thumbs, and allowed me to get past those liquors without taking any damage. Now, here's the tough part. I should probably, I don't know, let him get, hit me right here. So when I drop, I got all this room to do all one of those joints on him. Instead of being real tight right here. Got a slight, literally not much more room, but there's more room if I fucking hug the walls and get around his punk ass after he socks me. Literally just jabs me to my knees, that's how powerful he is. Just a little, little left jab and I'm on my knees. All fucked up. A little bastard. I mean, that big bastard. He's powerful. Just powerful. Knock your ass out. Alright. Come on, get your hit. 
good shit. See, that's what's supposed to happen. He hits you once, then he goes for his dumbass double axe handle blow from up top. And you run past. I got I got caught in some nonsense the last time. Damn, he didn't. He just didn't register that he already hit me. Now I gotta make it past the liquors. Maybe I should try to get that ink ribbon though. I'm gonna try to go for that ink ribbon because I need ink ribbons. I can hear those bastards out here, I'm waiting to feast on my flesh. Waiting. Hungry. I'm only going here to get this ink ribbon. Hopefully the liquor is far away and not close to me. He would have heard all that. Fucking glass and shit. Make all kind of noise now because I don't give a fuck. <laughs> I don't know where they are. No clue. <laughs> Can they come in here? No, you can't come in here. <sighs> this sucks. <sighs> Nerve wracking. I don't know why. I don't know why else I was thinking about what my next step was. I started walking slow. Those liquors got me confused. Oh, this is gonna suck. Yes! Ha ha! Woo! All right, man. What can I say? We are having such great luck. It's about time, right? Uh, what should I do now? I'm running out of time. I gotta go all the way over there. I'm missing a plug, though. It's supposed to be four, and I'm missing one. Where could it be? Oh, no. That's right, I gotta, I, I still gotta go and fucking... But that's just, no, I'm still missing. Oh no, I gotta do that puzzle. I gotta do the puzzle in the library. So, maybe I could go do that puzzle in the library first? Oh, is there liquors up here now? Great. I gotta go do that puzzle in the library to get that plug. And I still gotta go downstairs. There's a lot to be done in this police precinct still. Uh, get the gear so that I could crank out and get the very, very last plug, so. I definitely gotta go back down there and secure the, um, the gear first. Sucks. Yeah, I know, it sucks, but I gotta do what I gotta do. But that's gonna do it for this episode, guys. If you like the video, feel free to like it. If you want more, feel free to subscribe. You should absolutely like it because of the stroke of fantastic luck we've been having lately. It's just been great. And I've appreciated it. My, you know, my mind and, 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 and my, uh, really appreciates it. My stress levels appreciate it. You guys should show your appreciation and throw me a like. And uh, if you want more, feel free to subscribe, and I'll see you guys on the next exciting ex installment of Let's Play Resident Evil 2 Knife Only with zero practice, none at all. I haven't done this before, I don't know what the hell to expect with just this bad boy here. And uh, this is the Game Virus, I thank you for watching. Later.